Understanding, so it's decided. A guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore a common English phrase that you might encounter in conversations. So it's decided? This phrase is often used in various contexts and can be a bit confusing for those learning English. So let's dive in and understand its meaning, usage, and some examples to help you get a clear picture. So it's decided, is a phrase used to confirm a decision that seems to have been made by a group or another person. It's often used at the end of a discussion where a decision needs to be made. This phrase shows that the speaker wants to confirm that a final decision has been reached and that there are no more doubts or discussions needed. This phrase can be used in various scenarios. Here are a few, in meetings or group discussions where a team might have been discussing options and finally comes to a conclusion. In personal plans, like deciding on a holiday destination with friends or family. In informal settings, like confirming plans for a get-together or an outing. Let's look at some examples to see how, so it's decided, is used. Example 1. After a long discussion about where to go for dinner, one person might say, so it's decided. We're going to the Italian restaurant? Example 2. In a business meeting, after finalizing a project plan, a team leader might confirm, so it's decided. We start the project next week. There are other phrases that carry a similar meaning. Knowing these can help you understand different ways of confirming decisions. Is that the final decision? Have we settled on that? Is that agreed upon? Understanding these similar phrases can help you better grasp the context in which, so it's decided, is used. I hope this video helps you understand the phrase, so it's decided, and its usage in English. Remember, it's all about confirming decisions and making sure everyone is on the same page. Keep practicing, and you'll soon be using this phrase like a native speaker. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next lesson.